I need more friends. You're my only friend. I need more friends. Craft Island Brew Reviews and News. I'm Sammy R. <laughs> we haven't even started drinking. We're doing blonde beers, by the way. The Red Demon Red Rice Lager from Alicant. You make a weird face. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we have the Lawn Beer Blonde Ale from Best of Kin. We have the, how does one even pronounce it? Limoncito? Limoncito? Why, did, Limoncito? why didn't you just drop that pun with more emphasis? How does Juan even say that? Because it's... I said Juan. I didn't I do not no, make Juan said puns. Juan. You made a Juan pun? I did not. How about a Limoncito Loco? Thank you. I will not be doing that. <laughs> oh no. Uh, and my best friend's girl by Establishment Brew. Anyways, here we go. Despite what the name says, this lager isn't actually red. Oh, that's a good point. The Sri Lankan red rice enhances the flavor, but not so much the color. The combination of sterling hops and red rice creates a brew that's light in color and body and also crisp and refreshing. It's time to face your demons. Ooh, let's face your demons. Oh, we don't have time for that. <laughs> this is just a basic lager to me. Uh, well, yeah. Yeah. That's what loggers are. No, 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 but Pretty there's basic. nothing else going on there. No, it's just like a light lager. I taste a little bit of hops in there. Sterling hops to be exact. I don't um, know. I really like it. Yeah. Ah! Careful. I'm trying to, you bumped me. You watch yourself. Go fight. No. <laughs> I will cry. I like it. It's yeah. good. Easy drinking. Yeah. It's a lager. I, we can't do just IPA episodes. I had to pick something else. I like IPA episodes. So do I, but we can't do 10 IPA episodes. I'm gonna give this beer seven and a half eh, out of 10. I will give it a seven and a half. I was gonna try to come up with something way funnier, but um, it's my tough, brain. Right? There's just nothing there. Not, not there. Best of kin. Lawn beer. Such a, it just sounds like a dad beer. Yep. Well, that's bolder. I really like that. Designed for lawn sports, lawn chairs, and hard days of yard work. <laughs> yard work, it is a dad beer. It is a dad huh. beer. This American blonde ale is smooth and crisp with a subtle bitterness from special tea German hops. See? It's that's really smooth. Flavor. I really like it. It that's is hops. far more full bodied. I'm a big fan of that beer. I am too. That's the kind of lager I'm trying to mess with. Yeah. Good mouthfeel. Mm -hmm. Goes down easy. Mm hmm. You get those hops in there, so it's not nothing. Born. Yeah, I give that nine dad bods out of 10. Ooh. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm the best non dad with a dad bod ever. You make a lot of dad puns. Too. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna give that nine white New Balance grass stained sneakers out of 10. <laughs> what's, our, what's our news? Zombie eyed woman dressed as pig in swimsuit busted for DUI. One more time. One, what? I want to know what kind of party she was coming from. I was gonna say is not good for you. I guess a DUI actually doesn't mean she's that you're under drunk. The it was just under something. the influence of something. Mm -hmm. Zombie eyes probably, uh, man. If she's wearing a pig suit while sporting a bikini. That's funny as hell. I'm giving that 10 private porksters out of 10. Toy Story? Oh, fair. Hey, look, I'm Picasso. Nah, I don't get it. You want cultured swine? No? Yeah, I get it. It's the best line. <laughs> I just want to know how you get yourself in a situation like that. You live in Florida. Was it from Florida? I don't know. Yep, we're I going bet. with the yes. Yeah, probably. Don't drive under the influence. Limoncito loco? That's not bad. Okay. It is a... Salted lime lager. It was the most exciting lager I could find. Look Pin how cute the can is. Yeah, I was gonna say the pinata feels a little appropriate. -y. That's fair. Uh, this beer is by Bomber Brewing in Vancouver. Vancouver. Well, that's not a bad beer. It's kind of what I want a Bud Light Lime to taste like. Yeah, it's exactly what I want a Bud Light Lime to taste like. Mm -hmm. But is it a light beer? 4.6, so yes, but. Hold up. Not light, light. Mm -mm. It is kind of salty. That's mm -hmm. very weird. 
Yeah. I feel like salt and beer is such an old man thing. Really? I don't know. Like working in bars, the only time I've ever seen somebody salt their beer, it's an old man. You've seen somebody salt their beer? Yeah. That's People also appropriate. Like a- Leave it to the tequila. Do you, you don't put salt in your tequila, do you? No. I don't know how I feel about it. I don't think I like it. Mm. To be honest with you. I like it, but I would never drink more than that. one one flight. Yeah. Like, it's not a bad beer, but I, I definitely wouldn't seek it out by any means. No, it just reminds me of Mexico. Yeah. And Mexico reminds me of hangovers. I don't know what else reminds me of hangovers. Today. <laughs> Ooh, I'm doing great. It's a beach beer. It is a beach beer. Yeah. You're going to give it six. Un limoncito poco locos, which is kind of an insult to that song because that song is an 11 out of 10. It is. Da-da-dum. I'm not singing. You make me un poco loco. Un poquitito loco. I give it a six and a half. That's it. So we have my best friend's girl. It is a cold style ale. It's water. It's malty, but it is malty water. <laughs> malty water. Yeah. Oh God, let's trademark that. Malty water. <laughs> Start brewing our own beer, that's what we're calling it. I was gonna say we're gonna start a band. Oh. <laughs> Mul- like moldy water, but multi water. Multi water. I'm into it. It'd be a really good punk band. That's a great punk band name. Oh god. I just smacked myself in the tube. <laughs> it's really, really smooth. It is. Malt forward. It's not hoppy at all. What's the percentage? Because I feel like I could drink a lot of these. 4.8. Yeah. This is the problem with lagers. They don't make strong loggers. I was going to say they don't get you drunk, but... They absolutely do. Not at 4.8. I'm on a budget. That's fair. Uh, I'm going to give that beer 8 sh- Dane Cook movies out of 10. I will give it an 8. I'm really f- confused today. That's my rating. Being confused. Okay. These beers were just kind of all over the place for being all very similar stuff. I guess they're not similar styles. There was two ales in there, but all blonde colored beers. Yeah, very different flavors. Mm. Like a lot of the time I feel like when we do flights like this, like we get a couple that are similar and there's nothing similar about any of these beers. No. Which I did not like on purpose. I'm proud of you. Thank you. It took me a very long time staring at a beer fridge to pick these out. You done good, kid. Thank you. You want to do our secret handshake? I still didn't, I don't know what it is still. No, that will hurt me. I have boobs. Me too. (laughs) I'm Juan. I'm Sammy R. And you should probably not. I don't want to, but drink drink up, up, beaches. beaches. (laughs) I might cry to this day. (laughs) Sensitive. I have a lot of feelings today. I taste lime. I taste salt. (laughs) And you feel loco. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> <laughs>